All right, guys, welcome to the all British field meet, which is basically a car meet, but a different word for it. Uh, this is taking place at the Van Dusen Garden here in Vancouver, and we got our ticket $21 for an adult, uh, quite a bit cheaper for seniors and uh, children as well. All right, let's go check out, see what we can find. Quite a few cars here and some live music. Let's check it out. They're, they're tough. They're very tough. Oh, most, if you lived around here, if you bought a Camaro on most years, you never bought one of these Guys came all the way from Everett, Washington. Wow. Yeah, me too. I have Yeah. Oh, thank you. That is very clean. Cool MG. <laughs> it's original. So if you didn't get it from the title, all the cars here are British made. Some of them have uh, different engines in them, but the the bodies are all British. We have a tiger. Very nice. This is a 1966. This car is two years older than my dad. Good shit.
1967 Sunbeam Tiger. Oh, that is very clean. So it's a 1965. And the 64, wow, looks like they keep going down. That's crazy. Very clean interior as well. Oh, looks like there are some motorcycles over there as well. We'll take a look later. This one's a 65 as well, Sunbeam Tiger. It's kind of crazy how, uh, how some of these cars are in such good shape. Being uh, made in like 64, 67, 66. This one looks like it's had a couple of upgrades. Very nice. Another one from 65. <laughs> Very cool cars. Oh, look at those. Make sure you stay tuned so we can take a look at the cars over there as well. This one here is a collector, so must be in tip top shape. Let's take a look. It's a 1976 Spitfire. Crazy how uh, how little space the engine and the drivetrain takes compared to modern cars. This is a Triumph GT. Nice looking. Looking convertible. Wow, look at that one, guys. That's definitely had some work done to it. Amazing paint. Let's take a look at the interior. Very nice. Clearly, has had plenty of work done. Very nice looking 1972 GT. So obviously it will get pretty repetitive if we keep showing every single car, but uh, we'll try to show a few of each model, that way you get an idea of what's here. Look at this one, guys. Very cool right hand drive. Awesome. Got a bunch of minis over here. Wow. So cool.
I actually like these minis a lot. And there's quite a few of them out here today. Nice red interior. Of course, thick. Let's look at these ones here. What is this? Triumph. Nice matching interior as well. Very nice. Looks like it is a convertible. Something over here has caught my eye and definitely need to check these two out. So this is just a, I guess this one has been modified quite a bit. It is a six wheeled vehicle. Lots of aftermarket parts on there. We have this California. I don't know what, but it is a very cool looking car. Okay, we got some modern cars as well. But let's see if we can get some of the, a few of every single type here. So these are just the regular modern Mini Coopers. Looks like that's some Jaguar. These are pretty cool. <laughs> I have a Moke 25. Pretty cool looking, isn't it? There's a Morris Mini. Ah, oh, look at this one, guys. Super clean. Austin Mini. Morris. So pick up. And of course, you do have the pickup bed. From Surrey. So there's person here with a bunch of these. I've seen that name uh, on quite a few vehicles out here. Yeah, let's go to the back. This is cool. That is a tiny cabin. <laughs> and this one is a Bentley. VDP, the three liter engine. Very cool. These are uh, really unique compared to the other ones, so we'll spend a little bit more time and look at these beautiful Bentleys. Look at this one, guys. This amazing shape. 
There's a Rolls Royce. From 1924. This is a hundred years old, guys. That is insane. A hundred year old car. They don't make them like they used to anymore. Got the spokes wheels. Very cool. And of course, it's attracting quite a bit of attention. Got another Bentley. Very classic. 1936. Look at the interior. Very cool. He's looking for direction. More than I can give there you go. It's a different, totally different skill set. be capable of Cool looking Austin Mini. Another Austin. Very nice. An amazing shape. Look at the interior. So we made it this far. I think we'll go down this way. Look at a couple of these and now we'll make our way around. The Jaguar, of course, it's no classic yet. There's a nice Bentley. Trying to do things specifically to. This is a collector MG. You see the bump here on the. Oh, yeah. A few more MGs. Wow, look at Dane. This one is super clean, guys. The other thing is just um, making sure they're balanced so they're both pulling the same, yeah. you know, pulling the same balance. So. <laughs> Look at that. I'm using a pull uh, to keep yeah. the hood open. Yeah, it's, it's Same as a 1971 MG Roadster. And there's a few more minis here. Wow, that one has definitely caught my eyes here, this blue one. Look at this, the amount of work that's gone into rebuilding. That is amazing. So 1986. Yeah, this person has quite a few vehicles out. I've seen at least 10. And uh, we'll work our way back. Got a couple of more MGs. Let's see. 
Exactly. And it's the last twin car we went to a single. After this one. Which is like. So this is a 74. Very cool. I don't know if you guys overheard him, but he was saying that was the last twin turbo. But it stays on and it, no, there's no, like, is there a gasket or something in there? or is just... There's a gasket here. Okay. There but of course, this is all just air going in, so. If it's outside. Yeah. 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 It's different in. Right. The time you get done, you go, oh my god, the rubber pieces on this are all shot at everybody. Yeah. Turn around. Yeah, but I mean, if, if we didn't want to be that, then we get to be Very cool looking cars. Wow, look at these ones, guys. Crazy. Absolutely stunning vehicles. This one's from the 50s. That's cool. Look at the seat belts. <laughs> That's amazing. Beautiful color on this one. Wow, look how clean this one is. Very impressive. The paint, the engine, compartment, everything super clean. And it looks like there's some uh, pictures from the process of how they restored it. Very cool. Uh, looks like we missed a couple of these MGs here. Let's have a quick look. That's crazy. The dash looks stunning for what is this? Probably a 50s. Yeah, 47. So that's very impressive. from uh, Hawaii wow that is crazy they brought this thing from Hawaii very nice and another one here all right let's see what else we can find at the all British field meet we did take a look at these ones so we'll move on over one for Canada one for Europe and he was a billionaire oil guy up in north he built something in the oil Wow, look how clean this one is. 
hits you sort of right above the brim of your hat. So that is interesting. <laughs> as long as you don't look up. Yeah. Of course, I saw him put out 230. And I remember a guy trying to talk That's a very interesting way of holding down the hood. Another collector's. <laughs> Very cool looking goggles. And the seats. That's super cool. Alright, I'll see you next. I'm just right. trying to hey, we're we'll just trying to organize it. So there's a there's a, a suit, there's all the healings at the yeah. airport in Sydney. So that's what when is that? Tuesday. We need to think about this here. one's all the way from Ontario. Another one from Ontario. It's a couple of days drives you guys, that's crazy. All right, we'll work our way up and down. <laughs> Look at the other ones. This one's from California. Wow. All right, let's see these three, and uh, we'll continue back. Another Rolls Royce. Wow, that is great looking vehicle. Very nice. Another one here, blue. It's very nice, very nice. All right, let's uh, let's look at those couple cars we missed over here. Oh, this is the most traveled Austin. And I think she was at the But then what happened was I I have a friend of mine who was yeah. All right, I think All right, we were right there, somewhere right there where we left off. So, I well, obviously have some. It's a brand new, beautiful Rolls Royce Ashton Martin. Well, that's a very interesting looking vehicle. Let's have a closer look. Excuse me, can I take a look? Yep. Yeah. Uh, one and two. One and two. Very nice. Thank you. Now 
Those are crazy small, bro. That is cool. I got to see everybody that came by, but I just didn't. Uh, yes. These are very cool looking. I wonder what these do. Is that the gearbox? Oh wow! Looks like that's the gearbox there. Possibly the handbrake. Excited. Just cut through here. Sorry. Just a wonder. I'm gonna do that. I can give you my email address. Yeah. I've actually seen these at the Vancouver Auto Show. I'll put the link on the screen if you guys want to check it out. Here's another almost 100 year old Rolls Royce. Let's see if we can take a closer look. There you go, you can pause the video and read all the words. And here's the interior. Crazy. Very nice looking. Oh, yeah. The back, uh, usually you look at the uh, the deck and you can see a lot of wear. Another beautiful Rolls Royce. Here's one with 20 horsepower. 1927. This thing is a beauty. Very nice. That is a very cool looking vehicle. I must say. And of course, we have the brand new Rolls Royce Phantom. A month ago. Um, I bought it two months ago. Is that your retirement gift? Yeah. <laughs> wow, this is a beautiful I mean, vehicle, like a, guys. Yeah, Look at that. <laughs> yeah, well, now you don't Amazing. This is absolutely stunning. I think you can. And you can take this place if you palm and just stay still. used to be one some beautiful looking Rolls Royce vehicles. 
There's a collector's, meaning that it's in great shape and everything is original on the vehicle. Another collector right beside it. Very nice looking vehicles. Beautiful Bentleys. Very nice looking. I knocked the trans and I see I did twenty two hundred dollars down and I'm putting one little strap on Yeah, the actors. About twenty two hundred bucks by the time you can go over part. You got a few newer Bentleys. Newer models. Which again we have uh covered in the Vancouver and Bangkok Auto Show. Cool looking Bentley. It's 1936, so 90 years old roughly. I don't know what it is, but the look of these vehicles is just very impressive. Very interesting for me. Another beautiful looking Rolls Royce. Of course, we've seen these ones here. What should we do? Should we go there first or should we? Yeah, we could take a look at these cars here. This is a McLaren 720S. Beautiful blue color. Let's look at that. Very nice. Is it asked? Oh, I love the way that's cut out. It's beautiful. V12 5.2 twin. Wow. This thing, uh, it's too tinted. You can't really see the inside, but very nice looking. Alright, so I think we'll go this way and then we'll come back from the back row. Here's another Aston. It is starting to get very hot. Couple more triumphs. <laughs> you see, I'm from the generation that thinks Triumph only makes motorcycles, and uh, seeing the cars out here is like uh, kind of eye-opening and uh, interesting, because I've never seen them out here.
Not that old though, really. They had to take the, the joint that they put in last year. Just, just have me yeah. You want to know about the four, the four seater? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice looking vehicles. The DBL. This one is absolutely beautiful. I love the look on that one. Yeah. Here's the Rolls Royce Phantom. I didn't mistake the other one uh, for a Phantom, sorry. Guys. Look at that, just absolute beast of a vehicle. <laughs> Up our Land Rovers. Look at this one, holy. That is looking crazy. What a beast. more ranges got this beast here well I went to land over yeah I showed up with the oil filter the fuel filter and the air filter we can't buy these cans gave them the manual emailed them the manual what do you think they charged me for the twenty nine dollars plus yeah, these are some beasts. Take these off road, man. Another defender. Beautiful McLaren, man. Look at this thing. What an absolute unit. Oh, beautiful carbon fiber skirt. Look at that. Super nice. Another one. 
It's a cool saying right there. Yeah, I'm not designed to become second or third, I am designed to win. Nice. I'm never getting that. Alright. I believe there's only one section left and it's over there. So let's go over and have a look, see what we haven't seen yet. By the way, I'm rocking the mustache for now. See how it feels. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I think it's huge. I think we've probably done two thirds, if not less. So, what should we do? Start from here, I guess. This is gigantic, and there's a section with motorcycles as well. So, I was mistaking, it's not just a car show. But it is majority cars, so. Nice looking Jaguar. <laughs> Alright, I guess we're gonna look at every single car here then. Very nice looking cars. This one's an automatic, yeah, because of my back I can't drive a stick anymore. So. Get this one, guys. What a beauty! And it is a collector's plate, so everything is original. It's carbon fiber. So nice. Look at this Corvette, kind of out of place here. And we have a Lamborghini, that's definitely not British. Mercedes, oh look at this one guys. 
so clean. That is beautiful. Here another Aston. Jaguar. And for some reason, Nissan made it, even though they are Japanese, but they are here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I just stood there. I just they play happy clappy, you know, like yeah, I'm just having a good time. Don't change your story. And if you, I would much rather have a troll, which is very popular. I'm surprised they haven't done a re-roll. Yeah. 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 So this is 42 grand. <laughs> Alright, so that was a section of vehicles for sale. So that's why you got a random Lamborghini, Mercedes, Nissan, and other vehicles. It is supposed to be British uh, field meat, so all the vehicles here are supposed to be British made, except those ones that were for sale. Another Jaguar. All right, as we get closer to the live music, I might have to put something over it because uh, YouTube doesn't like uh, having music on your videos, especially when you don't have license for it. So we don't want to get a copyright strike, so we might have to mute it or put a different song on. There's a Mor Morgan Roadster. Cool looking cars. Some vintage Lotus. 
cars. Another Jaguar. Let's look at the interior of this one here. And my personal favorite part, the motorcycles. Let's see what they have. Did you see my guest? Is that you? Yeah. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Size. It was like 300 
Oh, well, look at this one, guys. Of course, you have a newer one as well. Nice touring one. Cruiser. Very nice. Well, make sure, make sure you get the, uh, uh, don't use pop rivets. I'm not talking about the brand, but don't use the brakes. Cool Range Rover. I guess land rover. We saw this uh, vehicle at the Vancouver Auto Show. So again, the link is in the description if you want to see modern cars or the Bangkok Auto Show. Lots of vehicles to look at there. The booth selling all sorts of stuff. Got some car models. There's a 50 50 ticket. Booth. I don't know what you could win. But. That's a cool looking one. It's got a cage and everything. Ready to hit the racetrack. No, no worries. And uh, of course, there's uh, fish and chips. It is a British. Meat, so they definitely have to have the fish and chips. All right, guys, thank you for watching the video all the way to the end. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like and subscribe. Until the next video, ciao.